Why do you think Washington isn't working now? I think because politics has become too personal. Um, you know, it, I, I, was, uh, I came up in politics where there were great, great divisions in the country from the civil rights, in, in the United States Senate, divisions on civil rights, women's issues, the war in Vietnam, future wars. And, uh, but I was, I was trained by a guy named Mike Mansfield, who is a former leader, a senator. He said, it's always appropriate to question a man or woman's judgment, never their motive. We spend more time today questioning motive than we do judgment. Would you say both parties? I would say sometimes yes. By and large, it is, it's been, as that old expression goes, the tail wagging the dog. There are a lot of good people in the, in, in, in the Tea Party, but their objective is they don't want anything, the government involved in anything. They're not liberal or conservative, they're anti-government. So their ends are met best when nothing happens. But you cannot sustain a democracy without arriving at a consensus. I think the American people are gonna change what happens here in Washington. I think they're getting sick and tired of, uh, of us uh, not being willing to uh, understand that in a democracy as heterogeneous as ours, as, div as different as it is based on race, religion, culture, there needs to be a consensus. And those people who stand in the way of forming a consensus, I think are people are gonna be, uh, are gonna, the, the, the system will take care of it. It may take one more election, it may take two, but we've been through periods like this before. <laughs>